Hello and welcome, my name is Skitcraft, and welcome back to Contraband Police, Part 5. Yikes. Oh, that scared me, I saw all red. So, yeah, I picked up exactly where I left off, just because I'm kind of getting into this. Let's see what goes on today. What day is it? Are you sure? Great so apparently the Olympics are being held in our country, so they want vehicles with more than three technical defects will be prohibited from entering. So that's the windows, the mirrors, the bumpers, all that. Vehicle registration document as of April 28th. New stricter regulations apply in the territory. According to visitors, are required to present a vehicle registration document. Any errors in the document should result in refusal of entry. Yikes. Great cleanups. Preparations are underway throughout the country for the long awaited 22nd Olympic Games. For the sake of the correct image of the country, the party is introducing the duty of social action. Um, every citizen is obliged to perform 10 hours of community service a week. Let this busy period be a testimony to the strength of our nation's spirit. Changes in the labor market. Okay, so the employment restrictions are temporarily suspended. So, if you're a teacher, artist, journalist, come on in. Truck scale. Check whether a given vehicle does not ex oh god. Check whether a given vehicle does not exceed the permissible total weight. You will find it in the vehicle card and in your service manual. Remember to mark any violation in the inspection report. Oh, this is this is right here. Come on in. Oh, we got smugglers galore. We got JPV, color red, a, and a Karistani, and then a broken window. Well, you're not doing well already. Oh, jeez, the vehicle card. Alright, so, defected bodywork because of this. Lights look good, bumpers there. Lights all look good. I'm curious if like the overall condition of this vehicle, because there's pricked or rough. Like rusty? I don't know if they count that. Alright, so we got three luggage. Oh. Um, well, actually, just make sure we got all of them. Yeah. Alright, so that's wrong. Cargo list is wrong. Vehicle weight, vehicle type. Compare with the duty handbook in the vehicle section. Registration number. License plate with the vehicle card. There are two more things that I'm going to have to learn. And every inspection is going to take an hour and a half. So YQD 6275XD. Okay, well that's, that's wrong. So yeah, 62. So the registration number is wrong. Is it 1520? Okay, so that's good. A Varilla 4x4. Um, vehicle type. 
Four by four. Wait, oh yeah, that's that's wrong. Yikes. Eagle type is wrong. He has. Looks like he has the Zaved. Yeah. Jeez. Now I see why this is like necessary because this is rough. J O Z five okay. June. It's weird. I don't have an expiration on this. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay, just making sure. So the cargo list was wrong. Vehicle types wrong. Registration numbers wrong. Passport number. I did that. Expiration date's good. Name is good. Okay. Denied. Oh, both mirrors? Good. I'm curious. Hundred and twenty. Dude. The photo? Oh, I didn't even check the photo. It's always the simple stuff, because I'm looking at all this like super intricate things. Bananas. I'm so sorry. I wish I could clean you up. I feel confident about that one. Oh my gosh. Really, dude? Yikes, that wasn't even close. Ah, oh, missing bumpers. Two of them. Rats. All right, well, that's a red vehicle if I ever saw one, so we're just gonna get out of the vehicle. There she blows. Weapons. So, more weapons. Oh yeah. Let me just arrest you and then I'll I'll do my little inspection. Yeah, quite a bit so far. something no oh gotcha okay I think 
That's all she wrote. And we'll find out. Oh my, maybe a little word. There's another one in the engine and there was one under the passenger seat. What about my business? I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Yeah, those inspections have taken a while. That was day eight. Three hundred dollars that day. Not terrible. Not awful. Alright, we got any flat tires here. Alright. So I'm gonna trade. Got coffee, nineteen. Sure, I'll snag one. JPB. Oh my gosh. There he is. Get out of that car, you dirtbag. Nothing else, I can just take all this for later. Get the way. You're a bad person. What should they not? All sorts of time. Oh. I'm just gonna check all this. See if I got it all? Probably not. Oh, I didn't even check the engine. Oh. All the tires and the sun visor. Whatever. Corpse of a man was found underneath the. Oh, found in the bare end. Oh, cool. Talk to the sergeant. Why is everything timed? I guess that makes sense. Gotta be ready for our detective work. Heck yeah. Mysterious murders. No, crime scene. Pretty much dirt roads the entire way there. Oh! Oh! Okay, yeah. That'll, that'll probably be good. Drunk a bear in. What's the situation? It's found by a cleaner in the back of the building. Six suspects? Check all the clues and come back to me. 
Interrogate the suspect, search the body, find the murder weapon. Let's see what we got here. The suspect? Alright, so these are six guys. I'll go back and check the body. Search body. Watch. Visible initials VM. Take that. Oh my gosh. A little detective. Huh? Whatever blood this is, this is strong. Not even wiping off his boots. Where the hell is this guy going? Kitchen knife. Well, well, well. smears or something. Wait. Vassal Morin. Visible initials VM. Well, I was the only one with visible initials of that. So he did. That was his watch. So talk to Torin. Or Timur, something like that. He's got sick dad. He's got sick dad. He's Oleg was not so happy with this promotion. Was so happy. He wanted to clear some debt from me. Hmm. What about you? Some guys from the butcher shop came in to throw back a few. So the cleaner came to tell me what he found in the back, he was pale as a ghost. Okay, so he put a little bit of shade on the guy over there because he has a little bit of debt. What do we got in here? Anything? No. No. Is there any doors? The cleaner. I tried to take up the trash, turned out the warehouse door was locked and the keys were gone. Went around and found the body. I saw the one who was dead had a fight with a guy in a beret while playing cards. Talk to the sergeant. Guy in a beret? Is that you? Only guy wearing a beret? Ooh, you're dead, dude. So, 
what happened was my Sherlock moment. Those two gentlemen. Let's see even back up farther. Oleg went here to get his promotion after 10 years of working. Everybody's having a good time, all playing cards. And all of a sudden, Oleg and Varen, or whatever his name is, were playing cards. And then Oleg's like, I bet you that watch. And Oleg was like, I'll give you my everything. But the guy with the watch lost. Gave him the watch, was super mad. So we killed him. He's dead. Let's release Petroski and the bartender. Oh. I have to release two at a time? Okay, well, I... Morin is definitely... Okay, the bartender is super innocent. I don't understand why the bartender would do it, so... Because the bartender's innocent, Petrosky is definitely innocent. According to the cleaner, the guests left the building moments after 7 a.m. They could not have gone far, looking for signs of a party near the garden. Well... This... Is the garden? Locate the venue in the garden area. Oh! Interrogate the suspects. Okay. I just look at him like, oh, more information. Beer. So much beer. What's up, buddy? What were you doing at 7 a.m.? We were sitting under the gazebo and the booze ran out. Timur went to the bar to get a bottle and Oleg had to go to the toilet behind the building because the one in the bar was closed. Igor fell asleep and I was alone with Nikita. Ah, rats. Timur suggests that they move outside and barely made it to the gazebo. I blacked out on the spot, so he did fall asleep. When I wake up, when I woke up, Oleg was no longer at the table, but we had something to drink again. When I went to get the bottle, I saw the cleaner walking behind the building. He looked like he was trying to hide something under his clothes. When the guests moved to the mansion around 6, they left a terrible mess. Went out for a cigarette and saw one of the guests walking back, walking to the back of the building. I think they called him Timur. Talk to the sergeant. Oh, jeez. Oh. oh, my goodness. This is tough. So... Who do I think is definitely innocent? Okay, this guy. Igor Sahayev. He is definitely innocent. But then... Oh, but they grouped them together. That way if you say Sahayev, then... Like, oh, Morin's also good. Which is weird, but oh well. Because I don't think... So... Trying to hide something under his clothes. So I still have one, two, three, f 
I have four people. I don't think it's Kuchenko. When the guests moved to the mansion around six, they left a terrible mess. Went out for a cigarette and saw one of the guests walking back, walking to the back of the building. I think they called him Timur. Is it this guy? Yeah. So he went to get the bottle. So they saw each other. So I think that maybe the watch is uh, like a, a red herring, maybe? It kind of wants, wants us to lead off like, oh, I definitely killed him for that. It's all the purple. Oh, man. Oh, it's because of this. Um. Well, I, I definitely don't think Sahayev did it, and I don't think Temur did it. But they deliberately put them not together. The cleaner... It's tough. I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this. So cleaner was apparently hiding something. Um. I'm gonna say Timur and the cleaner are good. Ah, I just. Yikes! We finally managed to open the warehouse. You can look around there now. Search the storage. Where's this? That outside that little shed. Is this? No. No, it could be this. Oh! Game lost. The murderer got you. Made the wrong decision. What? My Sherlock moment. Talk to the sergeant. Okay, so Sahayev and Morin, they're good. I bet it's that damn cleaner. Managed to open a warehouse. You can look around there now. So, if I go in here and I die, that means. Well. Suspicious letter. Commander, as per your order, I figured out Oleg Bogdanov and I confirm his connections with the KGP. Snitch will die today. Long live free Akaristan. Timur. Arrest the murderer. Time to go in the jail. Okay, that was me, but don't feel sorry for him. He's just a snitch because of the filthy little bastards. My wife and many innocent people are in prison. Sick government turns people against each other. Hmm. Oh, wow. Oh, so I can cover it up. I'm gonna arrest him. Government all the way. Revolution has already begun. Whoa! In desperation, Tamara pulls out a knife hidden in his shoe and swings at you. Thanks to the quick reaction of Sergeant Baikov, you come out of the situation unscathed. The killer, wounded by gunshot, ends up in the hospital awaiting his trial. He took the side of the government, 800 bucks. Yikes, dude. Um, buildings. 
eight people, dude. Nobody's having a good time. But I do want to do this. With the nice... Oh. My next thing has to be... Um, that big truck. Because if I don't have that, then it's kind of useless. Because this holds... 50? Jeez, um... Capacity is 5 in my vehicle? Oh, it holds 5. Okay. So that, that should actually work out. Yikes. Come on in. I just had to... die, but... WRP793... A cover stun and a broken window. Windows look good. Nice. I guess the coffee was a good deal. Laundry detergent. Eh. Um, I got my cocaine. Okay, a pack of cigarettes. Definitely not buying from him. Laundry detergent. I still feel like 15 is probably the way to go on that. So. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna put that away. But I mean, I don't wanna. <sighs> I am not gonna do well because of that. I better get these perfectly right. Oh my god. I'm just gonna hold shotgun shell. You know what? No. I'm just gonna... Cargo. Oh, look at that. Oh. Oh, I am... Straight dirtbag. Yikes. He wanted everything that the last guy had, so... Pack of coffee, 34. Actually, that kind of helped. Because I sold quite a few cigarettes. That was like four or something like that. And then three. So I made back a couple hundred maybe. After gunning them down. You're in. You are so in. Everything you have, bring it in my country. Boop. Now, if you're a smuggler, you you deserve it because you know, you're just very minimal. Perfect inspection. It's been a long time since I had one of those. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Perfect. We have a lot to do tomorrow. That way it's saved. I don't have to deal with it. Day 9. Daily cost, negative 325. Yikes. Oh. Alright, so I got 575. 579. Not bad. But, that is all I have left for this episode. I'm in 8 seconds exactly an hour in. Minus editing. But yeah. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Kitcraft. I'm pretty excited to see where this goes. It's just a fun game. It's a lot of stuff, but even if you miss some of it, you still get some money. So, I even I even shot a guy. 
I killed him. I shot him when he was dead. And I still made... Actually, no, I... Yeah. Murder. Minus $500. Mission complete. 800. Item sold. Correct check. Yeah. Oh, dude, I would have made some money today. Negative 66 balance. Negative 500 for that murder? Yikes. I would have made some money. But I didn't. I killed someone. Twice. Oh. Huh. Super fun. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Sometimes I just forget to say that because the goal is to just make content, not beg for affirmation. But if you like it, give it a like. If you want to say something, comment. And if you want to keep seeing more of this, subscribe. I'm Skitcraft. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.